Good evening, good evening, good evening, my YouTube family. Just making this quick video. The title of this video is going to be, Why Can't Most Folks Read the Bible? You want to know why people spend so much money going to church and paying preachers and pastors to translate the Bible for them? Well, I'm going to tell you why. The Bible is a very extremely hard book to read. And here's why. Everyone can't read it. It has nothing to do with your, your literacy skills. It has nothing to do with none of that. Simply put, the reason why folks can't read the Bible is because they don't have a fear of God. If you don't fear God, you won't be able to read the Bible. That's how it works. You won't have any understanding. You won't have any desire to want to read it. And we all know that if you're not interested in something, you simply can't do it. You know, it's hard to do things that you're not interested in. And reading a book like the Bible for someone who has no fear of God, you're not going to be able to do it. It's blocked. God blocks the Bible from your mental if you don't have a fear of him that's why it's stated in scripture the beginning of wisdom is the fear of god and i know this from experience because i you know when i was growing up i didn't believe in god i thought the bible was hogwash and i would get into a lot of debates with people who did believe in the bible and I would say to myself, you know what, I don't know much about this book other than what I heard about it or what I've heard people say about it. I think I would be more effective if I actually read this book. My arguments would be way more effective. So I said I'm going to, because, you know, I like to read. I'm a, I've always been a good reader, very avid reader. So I decided to try to read the Bible. And guess what, guys? I couldn't. My mental was totally blocked. And the reason it was blocked is because I did not fear God. Fearing God had a huge part in me being able to read and understand that ancient, very deep, very beautifully written book. It's the highest grossing selling book in the world. It is the most claimed to be read book in the world. And I couldn't get past Genesis chapter 1. It was almost as if I was reading another language. It was totally blocked mentally for me. And I'm going to tell you something. I wasn't able to read it until I got older. I went through some tragedies in life, and I wanted to truly and sincerely know God. It wasn't until I came to the conclusion that the things that was happening to me in my life <clears throat> that was negative was a result of how I was living. I, didn't, I never realized that. I didn't know that if I did dirt, I would get dirt. I didn't know that. I didn't know that if I stole, bad things would come to me. I thought that life was just random. I thought God didn't exist. I thought there was no spiritual forces that controlled anything, that everything was just totally random. And I was wrong. And once I realized that, I started to have a respect <clears throat> and a fear. For God. And, 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 and only through that was I able to read the Bible. So I'm not just speaking. I'm speaking from experience. So there you go, folks. If you want to know how to read the Bible, if you want to read the Bible, you have to have a healthy fear and respect of God first. Once you have a healthy fear and respect of God, then the Bible 
will be opened up to you and you'll be able to read it. Okay, so I'm going to leave it at that. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. God bless. Have a happy, happy, wonderful day. Thank you, guys. I'm out.